I'm really sorry about what happened in the gym. I, I had no idea you couldn't dance. Decent night, huh? It's my birthday. You say it's your birthday. It's my birthday, too. Don't do that, okay? Hey, June. Just stop it, okay? I mean, it's really been a shitty birthday for me. No offense, but I don't need a serenade right now. What's wrong? You didn't get anything good? Or? I didn't get shit. Not even a happy birthday. My whole family just sort of blew it off. I'd freak if my family forgot my birthday. It's a brand new year. I'm 16. Everything should be platinum. I should be happy, right? Right? Yeah. Well, I can't get happy. It is physically impossible for me to get happy. Would you feel better if you knew one of my secrets? Or... Don't gross me out. No, we're not talking gross here. No, it's just... It's just embarrassing. This information cannot leave this room, okay? It would devastate my reputation as a dude. No problem. <clears throat> I've never bagged a babe. Stud. <laughs> I got the rep in sixth grade, and it like, I don't know, it stuck with me. I'm just going home. Look, I appreciate you not laughing, okay? <laughs> I'm sorry. It's not what I meant. I meant. Pardon me. It's okay. I meant that it's okay that you did it once, but I didn't mean for you to do it again. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You know, just now I really felt how much you like me. I'm probably zoning in on my brain waves or something. Well, not really. I felt it on my leg. Come on, I don't want to see it. Oh. Sorry if I embarrassed you. I'm not embarrassed. Fresh breath's priority in my life. You know, I really don't want to hurt your feelings because it's really human to listen to my bullshit. I care about it, really. I mean, I, mean, I know I came on kind of like a poser on the bus tonight and everything, but that's just so my friends won't think, you know, I'm a jerk. But they're all pretty much jerks, though, aren't they? Yeah, but the thing is, I'm kind of like the leader right now. Kind of like the king of the dipshits. Well, that's pretty cool. Hey, but a lot can happen over a year. I mean, you could come back next fall as a completely normal person. Yeah. Sure. Would it be totally off the wall if... if I asked if I could have sex with you? You know, you asking me is not as off the wall as why I won't. BD? <laughs> no. I'm sort of saving myself. It's really stupid. He doesn't even know I exist. Oh. Oh. Jake Ryan. You like Jake? J Jake's my boy! I just talked to Jake in the gym. He asked me about you. Did not. He did, too. He did. He asked me what you were like. Oh, my... Oh. If you're lying, I'll beat the crap out of you. I'm not lying. 
Oh my God, what should I do? Should I go up to him or should I say, hi, Jake, I'm Samantha? Or no, maybe I should let him come to me. This is not my department, huh? But what if I decide to let him come to me and then he forgets? Or then what if he changes his mind and then I'm totally screwed, right? Apparently so. What would you do if you were me? I'm a gambling man by nature, and um, I'll go for it. This is so strange, but I think I will. Oh, you're the best. Wait, um, what? Do you know anything about floppy disks? Um, we'll talk about this in the bus, okay? Well, no. See, the thing is, I got kind of a problem. Well, floppy disks are pretty expensive, and see, the thing is, I made a bet with my friends. The, the dipshits, my, um, I bet them that I'd do it with you. But this is before I knew you as a person. I can get proof without actually getting physical. How? I brought you underpants for 10 minutes. Oh, yeah.